Okay, this is me. I'm going to do a recording of me trying to pray out loud. My pin camera may filter it. And I'm recording on here so it's blank. I'm going to turn this on. See how it's going. And I just spoke there. That's, that's me speaking there, those wavy lines. What I'm going to do, see TV's not on. There's no other sound on. My mom's TV is on in the other room, but that's the only other thing that's on. I'm going to pray out loud. And if all things hold true, unless it's filtered out on my pen camera to here, you will not be able to hear my voice at all. You may not even be able to hear it on. This is pre recording. So here it goes. My Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, and earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our, day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and power and glory forever. So that's the Psalms that I'm reading from. King James Version. And they are Lord, do I put my trust. Let me never be ashamed. Deliver me in thy righteousness. Bow down thy ear to me. Deliver me speedily. Be thou my strong rock for a house of defense to save me. Love a rock and a fortress. Therefore, for thy name's sake, lead me and guide me. Pull me out of the net today have laid privily for me, for thou art my strength. In the thine hand, I can put my spirit, as I redeem me, Lord God of truth. I've hated them that regard thine vanities, but I trust in the Lord. O oh God, I rejoice in thy mercy, for thou hast considered my trouble. Thou hast known my soul in adversities, and hast not shut me up in the hand of the enemy. Thou hast set my feet in the Lord's room. Have mercy upon thee, Lord, for I am in trouble. When I was consumed with grief, yeah, my soul in my belly. When my life is spent with grief, and my years are sighing, my strength fails because of my iniquity, and my bones are consumed. I was a reproach among all my enemies, but especially among my neighbors, and a fear of mine acquaintance that they to see me without opposing me. I forgot there's a dead man out of mine. I'm like a broken vessel. I heard the slain of many, fear was on every side, while they took counsel together against me, they devised to take away my life. But I trust in thee, O Lord, as a thou my God, my time is in thy hand. Don't know from the hand of mine enemies, and from them that persecute me. Make thy face to shine upon thy servant, save me for thy mercy's sake. Let me not be ashamed, O Lord, while I've called upon thee. Let the wicked be ashamed, and let it be silent in the grave. Let the lion lips be put to silence, silence which speak grievous things, proudly and contemptuously against the righteous. Great is the goodness of the Lord that trusts in thee before the Son of Man, because I keep secretly in the pavilion from the strife of tongues. Blessed be the Lord, who has showed me his more with kindness in a strong city, who has said my haste, I am cut off from before thine eyes. Nevertheless, the heart is the voice of my supplications when I cried unto thee. O love the Lord, I hear you, saints, for the Lord preserve the faithful, and plentifully reward the proud dearer. Be good courage, and he shall strengthen your heart. All I hope in the Lord. That's the way this thing is still going. I'm still going to read the, uh, that psalm. The Psalm 52, King James Version. Why boast thyself in mischief, O mighty man? The goodness of God endured and continually. Thy tongue devises mischief like a sharp razor, working deceitfully. The love is evil more than good, and lying rather than to speak righteousness, Siva. The love is all divine word, though thou dost deceitful tongue. God shall likewise destroy thee forever. He shall take thee away and pluck thee out of thy dwelling place, and with thee out of the land of the living, Selah. The righteous also shall sing in fear, and shall laugh at him. Well, this is the man that may not got his strength, who trusted in the abundance of his riches, 
to strengthen himself in his wickedness. When I'm like a green olive tree in the house of God, I trust in the mercy of God forever and ever. I praise thee forever, because I have done it, and I will wait on thy name for this good before thy saints. Psalms 58, hopefully the pin camera is still going. Do you need to speak righteousness of congregation? Do you dare about the only son of men? Yea, in heart, you work wickedness. You play the violence of hands in the earth. The wicked are strained from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking high. The poison is like a poison of a servant. They like the death out of the stop of the air. Which will not hearken to the voice of trauma, trauma nervous or wisely. Break the teeth, O God, in the mouth. Break out the great teeth of the young lion, O Lord. Let them out of ways waters, which run continually. When it bends his bow to shoot his arrows, let the beast cut in pieces. As a snail would melt up, let every one of them pass away like the time of birth of a woman. That they may not see the sun. Before your pots can feel the thorns, he shall take them away as with a whirlwind, both living and in his wrath. The righteous shall 